Greetings. I uh, just wanted to kind of give you a little bit of feedback and kind of talk you through the next activity that we're going to be doing. Great job on discussion for week one. Um, I went through and graded the first, of, for those of you who had posted at least four, and you guys are knocking my socks off. I know you have a lot on your plates, but you're doing a great job. I haven't looked at chapter two yet, and uh, I noticed in my feedback as we were discussing that some of my messages were taking on a different tone. So, you know, just watch for the feedback on there too. Great job, great start. I know this is a lot of work to do. I hate that we're having to double up on content, but that's the nature of the summer course beast. So bear with me. Um, since we're going to hurry up and take an exam, our first exam, I gave you some um, hints. Just please make sure you give yourself enough time. Use a reliable computer. Do all those things, you know that. Have your materials ready. But for the discussion board for chapter four, that would be the, so chapter three's discussion is gonna be normal. Chapter four is gonna take on a different tone because I thought, you know, you guys have a lot on your plate. I don't want you having to worry about my 10 questions that you can choose from. I want each of you to choose a topic and just do a super short, you know, one to two paragraph discussion of it, what you think that we need to know on the exam. Um, and the topic is anything from chapter four. I am afraid that because we're doing the blog assignment, you're gonna get a little confused. I'm not too worried about it. Send me questions. So basically for chapter four's discussion board, I want you to choose a topic from chapter four, give a super short presentation, summary, uh, include a source, whether it's a website that gives great information, an interactive game, or a short video clip, an image that really says a lot to you and maybe explain that. That's really what I'm looking for. Now, to get the other posts for it, students are required to respond to three other posts. So basically, you're still kind of looking at a minimum of four uh, normal discussion posts plus claim your topic. So don't get too confused. I am a little worried about that. Usually I don't do a video, but uh, just do that. And if, and if you're still not quite sure, you just email me. For Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday of this week, I am in a workshop and they're asking us to put our electronics away, so it may not be quite as quickly as I like to respond, but go ahead and give it a try. Hey, have a great week, guys. Good luck on exam number one.